Hey Dreamers, this is Jack to Place, and today we're going to continue with, of course, the fireplace. You could already guess. If you're new to this channel, and if you're watching this video for the very first time, you have no clue what this is about, maybe you should go back <laughs> to the very first video. Because as you probably have seen in the title, this is a number which we're like far ahead in the series. We are doing a Santa's, no, a Secret Santa community event. It's uh, organized by Yada, one of the dreamers in the Dreamiverse, in, in Dreams, basically. Um, to check it out, makes lovely plushies and other great content on Twitch uh, you should follow. But in this uh, series, we or I am going to make something in dreams and it's for a specific person. Um, I got it randomly. It's like an, an, yeah, like, I don't know how to call it in English, but like here, you know, we call it as a priest. So maybe it's also an English way to say that. But <laughs> like you get randomly picked by, by, uh, by someone and you have to scope something for them. Um, I decided to recreate a, a small part section a, a little part of their video game that they made in dreams and and, they, and gave a little bit of my own reimagined version of it so a, re, a reboot not really a reboot remake whatever you want to call it uh, a little like ejector style and my idea was like the scene starts in a fireplace or like near a fireplace and when you're going to like see the first the scene for the first time the camera zooms into the fireplace and then like it zooms out and then suddenly you are somewhere else and that is the creation or the reimagine the remake or the rebrand <laughs> the reimagine remake remaster version of uh, a little part of the game that he made uh, a, little, a little out that's what it is um i really hope that he or she is going to enjoy what i made <laughs> i have been working very long i don't know how long this series is going to run uh i'm uploading every like there will be two videos every week about this series so it's a long running series and um yeah i don't really know <laughs> how long uh where, where it's going to stop maybe it's going to be all the way till the end of like uh the next christmas uh, <laughs> that would be wild to be honest but yeah i'm putting a lot of like effort and detail in this one and uh simply because like i'm enjoying it it's something new and refreshing for me um outside of my comfort zone a little bit as well because like i'm doing something that it's not technically mine um and, I, and i'm talking not the, I talk, talking about the fireplace but I'm, talk, I'm talking about a game that someone else made and so it's not really yeah something i would have made but so i have to look differently if like okay how okay they made this game and how would i if I was that person, how would I have made that? So that's how I've approached it a little bit. A little bit of like an, an ode. Still, I try to respect the original creation, but still gave it a little bit of my own touch on it. Uh, but really want to keep the original uh, very uh, centered into like that you can see that like it's still the same. And um, yeah, that's what we've been doing. Um, sorry for the long intro. But that's what you're going to expect from now on. Um, so if you are like well, for people that are new, of course. So this is what you're going to expect. So we got working on the fireplace, and uh, this is what we have made so far. Um, the white one is the dummy. Basically, it, it's for me to see, um, yeah, what I, um, how I'm going to sculpt something, and um, like more of like placeholders for me, and I think that um i came quite far already we're going to clone this on the other side i might maybe change a little bit of like the design maybe here and there i do not know um but before we're going to actually continue i still need to add one more thing and 
that is this one here. There we go. Uh, let me close this down. Uh, we do how we do need, however. Um, okay, let me see how this is actually looking if we clone it like so, because that's where we're going to end up with. I think that looks okay. I think that looks fine. And I'm not, I don't, yeah, like I was talking about this. Like, I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this, but to be honest, you're not, so, <laughs> you're not seeing it anyway. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't think this is too bad. And um, yeah, in the previous video, I made like another bar here, like another plank. I don't think I will do that. I think less is sometimes better. Like, yeah, <laughs> it's uh, something I've learned in school. <laughs> So if my teacher is watching me, <laughs> I hope he, he is very proud that I actually like take his advice for the very first time. But yeah, le less is sometimes better. Not always, but <laughs> less is sometimes better. Uh, I'm just already going to like cut this a little bit into pieces, into a little bit more like style that I have been doing all this time. Make it so that the wood is not really perfectly round or perfectly straight, I mean. There we go, and I think that's fine. Uh, we all need to paint again. And then the question is, what are we going to do next? Because like, um, we are getting closer to this section. I might maybe going to do the walls. But I'm also going to maybe rethink to do the some props. Like we have still some props with the candle and a uh, I forgot the name again, but the candle and a thing. <laughs> and um, well, this little puppet uh, doesn't belong here, but um, yeah, maybe some, another maybe candles on the top here uh, or here in, in this case. Then um, maybe some Christmas cards. Um, but there is not really that much room here. Now, of course, we can do this. I can always, like... <laughs> I mean, I can all... I, of course, I can just... Um, like, do like this and make it a little bit bigger. Um, maybe that's actually not a bad idea, to be honest. And then close this. A little bit further down. I think that's not even a bad idea <laughs> to do that. Um, because then we can put a little bit more in front of it as well. I was thinking maybe to have some candles here and some Christmas cards. And we're going to do that thing that we have in our previous. We're going to place it over there. It fits perfectly. Um... So that's something that we're going to do with a candle inside and also, okay, maybe candles here on the side. Um, we're going to make it very Christmas looking. Um, that's the idea. Okay, I'm talking too much. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, but if you know me, I can sometimes talk a little bit. Sometimes I don't. Sometimes I'm just like super quiet and like focusing a lot. Um, but I can also sometimes be very uh, chit chatty. Okay, um, wedge technique. We make a hole inside. Uh, make this super tiny. We are in mirror mode. We should not forget to do that. Then make sure we are. Okay, that is already nice. And draw in some stripes. Simple as that, and maybe we can add some. Now we are working on it anyway. We can add some black in there too. So it's popping out a little bit. Let's do that also, by the way, with the sides. I'm not really sure if I already did this. No, doesn't seem that way. But just so that the wood is 
popping out a little bit better here and there and do that with the rest as well do, 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 do. Um, that was actually not so smart, but it, it luckily it didn't uh, turn out uh, being super weird. <laughs> Just that, like the wood has been a little bit more uh, popping out. See, I made here a mistake. Because actually, yeah, technically they are like cutting down here and here, but I, I might going to maybe wonder, like worry about that later. Um, but not for now. All right. We can clone this. And there you go. Done. That's the fireplace that we have built. It um, was uh, was not a big deal. So we, we can delete the yeah we can delete this one here. Um, save us some graphics again. Uh, even though it's cost twenty one percent, the reason why it is so high. Um, I can down this to like 4% if I want to, or maybe even lower. But the reason why I'm having it so high is because like, I'm going to use this in a bigger scene and, um, or like, or not really like a per se, like a bigger, bigger scene, but I'm going to use this like, um, like just like focusing on like only the fireplace and the wall a little bit maybe a window if i have the time um with snow falling in the background and then you're like zooming out or zo sorry zooming in in the fire and you're going to the other side that's the idea um i think i will leave the props for another day um so at least not, not in this video i think the safest bet for me um should maybe be let me oh i can also do it like this Ooh. and what if i then also do this if it's going to work let me I certainly had an idea. It does, however, <laughs> goes a little bit to it. Like the top doesn't really that much bother me that much, maybe, but still do it a little bit. Interesting. Interesting. Well, the reason why I'm... I think this is maybe not a bad idea to do it like this. Makes it a little bit more sense. Um, but then... I am... Going to build another one. Um, am I saying that this, because technically we need another one, right? Or in the same, uh, yeah, what I can maybe do. I can maybe... Uh, 
<laughs> I don't know. Ah, uh, maybe not. Maybe not. That, that that's that's who it is. Um, I will keep it like this. So it has a little like fun thing in the top. Okay. So fireplace check. Um, this one, however. Oh yeah, there was something that I need to fix. Still, I saw it like in a couple videos back, and. I don't really know why it didn't do it, but I really need to fix this. Uh, not in mirror mode, by the way. Uh, how is this looking? Yeah. Um. Need to make sure that it not like looks too obvious now. Okay, yeah, that's better. There's something weird here happening here. So let's see if we can plant this better in. There we go. Need to do that on. One, yeah, this was something that I saw and uh some time ago. Going to put a little bit more detail in these. Okay, I think that's fine. I think we are good to go with this. Alright, um, so the wall, we can do the wall now, um, <clears throat> which is basically we can reuse maybe something that we already created before, but then extend it. So it will add up graphics term anyway. And I'm talking about this piece here. I'm going to re I'm just going to reuse this as a piece of uh, wall and actually how does it look like if you place multiple things together yeah that's not going to look very, really well <laughs> um but i was thinking to have like a wall like this um like behind it but then we're going to extend it a little bit more. We do, however, need to be careful about the sides here now. Because there are text gadgets. I might even delete for each wall. I have to see how the performance goes. And under, under this section... I can maybe actually reuse um, something like this here. So this will not like cost myself um, any additional graphics because like we're going to reuse like uh, I need to see which side I'm going to reuse but probably so, like something like this, and then we're going to cover it up with, um, with wood on like in between the wall and, uh, um, but this is something we can do. Now, I know that maybe it's going to be a little bit harder to blend them in together. Um, that is a, that is definitely a thing, <laughs> and I don't see any other 
way to do it properly like this is the best maybe the best way to do it but then we are with this thing and and if i want to cut it down then yeah then we aren't really it's um i still need to see what i'm going to do with this because i do not really know also before or I'm actually um, taking to the next step. I'm kind of curious how it looks if we add a text displayer on the fireplace. Talking about this one here. So what do I mean is add additional structures to this. I've not really tried this yet. It can never hurt to try. I'll first make sure it like it's hitting on the thing here. Um how to fit out. Yep. And we do need to say texture, capacity zero. That also cool looking, by the way. <laughs> it's not what I want to go for, but <laughs> not bad. Um, okay, so What if we, what if we use um, something like, let me see. Oh, I still, wait one sec. We're still not in the right group. There you go. I don't want to affect the um okay now we need to find and maybe use this uh, oh, uh no come on I don't want to click on that um yeah, the problem is, is that like you're you're also going to be on top of all those stones. That is not really what I want to to do that. I have to be completely honest. Hmm. Uh, This is one really nice to make uh, really quick stone textures, to be honest. <laughs> like a brick version. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think like I can... Of course, I can always add more detail, but I don't really think I'm going to... I'm going to add much to this. Because no matter what I were going to add now, it will never look the same. Like it, it, it will lose the rest of the quality what we're doing, what, what we have been doing in the past. Looks cool though, still, but <laughs> it doesn't look so bad at all, especially not from afar. But, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. 
I don't know what it's um what it's what's what is smart. Don't know. I mean could be this. The question is Is it going to gain us I don't know I don't think I'm going to use a text gadget for this purpose of, of the whole thing here. <laughs> um, I'm getting super tired. Um, so, uh, um, yeah. I mean, <laughs> okay. Um, this is going to probably something for later i don't think i'm going to to do this so does that mean that i have to be <laughs> uh probably yeah what about this one here is there a way for us to recreate something without this like the reason why I'm saying it is because like um You can just make it so that this is just one piece of like you always want to add like as much or reuse a lot of assets much as possible because the fireplace is already pretty high and if we're going to add more of the same sculpture but then use it for different purposes we still have done a lot more to add other stuff like props inside the scene so basically reusing this without cutting into stuff is super nice to do and this may be and we need one like so um probably not going to see the ground anyway but I might want to cover this this part here with brick. Um, I think that looks way nicer to do that. Probably. Figure it out. So this is something that I what I had in mind to create. And then we can like continue on building. And probably maybe switch the two walls. <laughs> I don't want to like it looks like it's uh, that looks very wrong by the way. But <laughs> um, but make it so yeah. That doesn't seem so. So bad at all. Let me. I'm not going to like scope everything new here. I'm going to reuse some of the assets I have been doing in the past. Uh, I have a floor. Now it's not the best looking floor ever. In fact, it's uh, it's a very worse one. <laughs> but. Uh, is this 4%? Really? Was that 4%? Really? Uh. Oh, okay. Whatever. Um. I, let me 
scene. We have like uh, my creations. Virtual area. My assets. Environment. Indoors. Um, I think what we maybe can reuse is this one here. Very tiny compared because it's a nightstand. So it is like a one percent scope, but you can see that with like the. <laughs> Um, <laughs> same with a table. Um, I don't think I can put this here though. How funny would that be? <laughs> um, like this have a little bit of like a reference to Arias it's an original idea with uh, these uh, Japanese grain birds uh, or Chinese they're, they're also in Chinese very famous um, yeah I I do not really know if I want to keep like uh, What is smart? What is smart? It's sad that we don't have yeah, but we didn't paint this side. I can do it though. Then we have covered that up, but <laughs> and then use that as a stone structure. Not a bad idea, I think. Um, but. I can maybe be a little bit more uh, it's because like we made this wall Pull that out. Get a group. Do it like this. Oh, what? Now it's out. Uh, group. Mm. <sighs> I don't really think I can. Sorry for being a little bit quiet, but I don't think I can really do. Yeah, or I need to do this. <laughs> but then there's like a weird... I mean... Can't do it. 
It's only that this little thing is in the way. And I'm, if I remove that, we get an additional 9% extra. Um, that's a little bit sad, but <laughs> it is what it is. But it, it is a way to, to deal with... I mean, you have to do the same with... Um, what I want as well. But then we can just like reuse this asset without, yeah, without remaking it. Like so. Is that smart? No, let's not do that. No, because like, because I need to. Um. Yes. So now I can. Yeah, so if I do this, gets a little bit weird here, but that's totally fine. Ah, no. And oh, we have to do it in group. now I have the option yeah okay um so it's going to be like this like yes we rise up raise up nine percent I can however now that we have like touched this one I can however make this a little bit lesser still um but that will of course like yeah lower the quality uh, we can uh, can maybe live with it. I don't know. Um, the floor, however, I do not know yet. <laughs> um, oh, let me see if I can. I'm just trying to reuse assets as much as possible. It's just... I don't see... If, if I had like painted and sculpted it also on the, on the, on the back side, I could have maybe used it as a floor. <laughs> I can, I can still do it by the way. It's, um, it's definitely something I can do to use it as floor purpose as for purposes it's um it's doable like this um i'm just going to play a little bit around with some of Oh, right, and we need to... Um... No. I need this one here. Like so. Um... So, uh, like, the wall doesn't always... Hello, this one's... Wait, huh? 
Makes no sense. But I already changed that. There you go. And also flipping around. So I have a little bit of variation in the in the wall structure as well. There you go. I probably need to uh um see how am I going to recreate the window part the part. Um I was thinking to to have the window somewhere here. And as you can see, it's like it's snowing outside. Stuff like that. Okay, how am I going to do this here? <laughs> um, because clearly I want to have a bigger bar. Big. Bigger. Bigger is better. Uh, like so. I think, I believe, I don't know. Yeah, this can work. This definitely can work. Like we don't really have to make a full blown scene out of this. That's not really, um, that's not, that's not really something that I, I'm going for. Because, like, all I'm going for is when the camera, like, sets or takes place in the fireplace or, like, somewhere here. And then you can see that the window, with snowing outside, um, it looks maybe, like, not, like, super good at the moment. Um, but that's because like we didn't really well we have put some gadgets inside um and we did like um of course um yeah set set no we only just set the sun but not like the actual setting so um we need to make it of course look way better than this but i think it comes like turns out pretty well so far um, I think that reusing assets is a good choice. Sadly, we had to cut in the, in the fireplace, which was adding extra 9% graphics thermo. That is the sad part. Um, but the rest of the walls are not, so that's good. So we don't have to worry about that. Um, I think we are at 30% for a scenery is fine like this. I can downscale it really, really far uh, to make it 8% again, but just not doing it. I think I'm going to leave this video here and I will explain you a little bit why. I am a little bit tired. <laughs> I, I really was thinking I could do a full hour again. Um, we are like... 40 minutes in so it's not like it's uh it's that a short of a video but um i'm going to leave it here and i'm going to sleep and i'm going to dream about some ideas <laughs> uh no I'm, go I'm going to rethink about some um some things um how i'm going to approach the window Maybe I can make a cheaper um, a cheaper brick wall still. So we can like spare ourselves the 9% extra. That is a possibility to do. Um, I think it's not a bad decision to do that. But that's something like for the next video. Um yeah let me know in the comments do you like this series so far i know it's been a lot of videos i know it's been a lot of like sculpting and crafting and like doing logic stuff and i, I know there's like this a very long series and i don't even know where this will end 
Uh, well, I do know where it will end because like, I need to add, uh, finish this before the deadline. Currently, only four days left before the deadline hits. That's not a lot of time. It's getting a little bit slowly, a little bit more stressful for me because I need to finish this before the, 25, the 25th of December. And um, that's four days uh, from now on. So, yeah. <laughs> it's, um, it's not like I have like super long time anymore. We did do a lot. I did. I think that the time like creating this, I think we have been doing pretty well. I think we are over 20 hours of sculpting things in total, uh, including the other scene and then this one as well. Um, I really cannot wait to see this like whole scene like going to look with all the light and stuff like that. I am not really super happy with the fireplace itself. It looks... I, I think it could be better still looking. But let's see how that is going to look with some better reflection and lights and stuff like that. Um, maybe going to add another detail stone pattern on this one <laughs> stone pattern on the bricks on the rich original uh maybe i'll do it with flex i can maybe cheat a little bit here and there i have to see what i'm going to do but for now i'm going to say thank you so much for watching so far this whole series with me it is really joyful and so far like yeah, I think I think that 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 this is maybe not only the longest the longest series ever done, <laughs> but um, looking at like things like yeah, how I, I how is like how the fireplace looking and like what you like need to do and how to approach the sculpt and um, I try to do everything in one scope, but sadly it's not really that much possible. Well, it is technically possible, but you will lose quality, and I don't want to lose quality because, like, I want to make the look and feel like this is a scene not really made in dreams. I really like, want to make that feeling. And yeah, it's um, it's going to be a big challenge to finish this before the deadline. I think I'm maybe going to cut a little bit here and out, here and there out and do some of in my free spare time instead of recording it. Uh, because like recording stuff, it, it takes a, lo a lot more time uh, while sculpting and talking and uh, like discussing. And so for me, it like, feels a little bit more that I, I use more time by, by recording stuff. So I might maybe do a few stuff off the record. <laughs> and what I mean is that maybe I will do a little bit of like um, maybe the floor already sculpting uh, in, my, in my spare time. So I can speed that up a little bit for the next video. I can maybe considering to make um, an additional... Um, well, although I also want to show everything, the process, so I don't know yet. I will have to see what I'm going to do. I don't know yet. It's just, I really would really want to like not hold you away from like content that I'm like sculpting because like, I think the best way to learn is by, by just also seeing the struggles like this. And yeah, I really need to see like how I'm going to approach this, but um i'm so afraid that like like this particular video is like maybe already in the summer <laughs> it's like it's crazy to think about it uh but that's not for you guys like yeah i mean like you're seeing it on the day when you want to see it or like when you get to see this but for me it's just like yeah it's a long series we're going a long way uh i'm enjoying it of course and i cannot wait to see the reaction of the of the person itself uh, i really hope they will like the creation 
that I made for them. Um, can't wait for that response. I hope it's a positive one. <laughs> I hope it's not going to be any negative. If if it will be, then so it be. Um, but yeah. I'm going to say now, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Please take care. And as always, never stop dreaming, everybody. See you next time. Bye-bye.